Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to episode 9 of Rustic Waters 2. And um, in the last episode, we made the mechanical crafter. Yes, we did that. <laughs> and, um, yeah, that was that was the big thing of the episode. And it works and it looks awesome. I'm going to stop going around in circles. Sorry. <laughs> Um, in between episodes, um, I went down to the surface, well not to the surface, went down to the to the to the ocean floor and I mined up a shed load of um gravel. And I also went into a cave as well. But I made an extra two strainers so that we can get more resources coming in. So now I have four strainers going up to the top to get more resources, and then I can get more um, ingots and so on because oh nautilus shells when you go mining there's some blocks that look like they have faces in them or like a funny pattern and when you smelt them you get um the anamite am an amamite i think that's what it is blocks and when you smelt them they um they become nautilus shells which is interesting and finally, I've kind of semi-automated the campfire. So if I put that on, step back. Uh, let's just wait for it to pop up. Are you going to pop off? There you go. And it gets sucked up by one of those uppers. So, you know, it works. It's old school, but don't knock it. It works. I know that um, Delph had mentioned to me about using, he said he used something, absorption hopper, something, I can't remember. Couldn't remember it off the top of my head and I just, it was just quicker to use those. Oh, is that full now? Oh, um, no, yes. Oak logs, yes, we are full. Oh, that's excellent. Okay, no, don't put it in there. If I put it in the Coke oven, yes, I can make it, get it making charcoal because um, it doesn't use any fuel for that. So I can get it making charcoal and then, um, right. And then I can use the charcoal for making cold Coke. Uh, where are we? Those two, those two. Yes, so it's doing it automatic. It's making charcoal. And... Oh, I might have to... I might have to put another... Another thing? Why is it not... Oh, no. The bar is there. Yeah, I'm going to have to put another output for the charcoal. All right, do I have, I have a bin for the charcoal there. All right, let's make another storage drawer. All right, um, where, chest, storage drawer. Let's go around the back. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> oh dear, they all look the same. It was the same color. What do you want me to do? That's what I wanted. Right, so that's charcoal. So we've got the charcoal coming out. We've got the coal coke coming out when we need it. Um, and charcoal, there's only 13 in there anyway. Right, there you go. And the time in the bottle should work for this. I think it is going a tiny bit faster. No, it's not. I don't think it is. I don't think it's going any faster. Anyway, I thought it might have. It doesn't. Right. Um, on to today's shenanigans. Let's see. Put you away. I'm going to have to empty this out at some point. Dirt and the site. Where's the gravel? 
Okay, one of these days we will have this fully automated. But not today. I mean, it's pretty much a technical achievement that I've got it going and working. All right. And I'll probably need to check these drawers to make sure they're not uh, five, two, two, right? Seven. Redstone dust is getting full. Clay is full. Do I have a. Oh, I do have a storage upgrade. Oh, that's fine then. Um, and I think there's a storage upgrade in this one. Because this is the one with the iron. Yes. Yeah. Right. So we're, we're good. We're good. Right. On to today's show. Um, I was looking at the quests. I know they've got the power down here. We will get back to that. But this one, because I we've got two key fragments. And I want the third one to unlock an extra space. All right. So to get the third one, we need to do the blast bricks. So that's what we're going. And I want to do the base, the mixing basin anyway, because I'm kind of intrigued by it. So, um, so yeah, so it's, it will be the mechanical mixer, the basin and the brass, the brass bricks, blast bricks. Let's see if we can get that done today. Oh, dependencies, basin. Okay. Yeah. So mechanical basin and blast bricks. Let's go. Right, so mechanical mixer. The mixer has multifunctionality. While it does allow you to automate shapeless crafting recipes, its true strength lies in the ability to combine crushed ores and dust into alloys. It's best to insert the ingredients into the mixer in the order shown in JEI. And we get a spout. So how do you make the mixer? We need a whisk, we need cog wheels, and we need andesite alloy and andesite casing. Right. How much do we have here? Uh, andesite alloy. Brass casings. Do I have? I don't think I have any andesite casing. Okay, let's go over here. I can't wait till we get... And the reason why I wanted to go down that route as well is going that way, you get to storage terminal and Tom's Tom's simple Tom simple storage I think uh, but why is it gated under that because we made the storage terminal well at least I made it and the inventory connector and that's all the mechanical crafting. So I'm not sure why it's gated behind the mixer. But, you know, if we get down here, then I can sort out all of this stuff instead of having chests all over the place. Because that is annoying. Right. Um, Mechanical mixer and a side case. Oh, my days. I forgot. It's this. This thing. Okay. Right. Uh, treated wood planks. Let's bring over the treated wood planks. Anything else? No. Sticks? Yes. And I think what I will do, I will come back when I have made everything. Why am I making it sound like a question? I don't know why. Uh, we need... Yeah, I'm going to come back with it because you've seen me make this like four times this week <laughs> and it's annoying and I yeah it's just rinse and repeat I'll be back in a second um cogwheel mechanical mixer there you go right the whisk was very simple to make it's iron plates and two andesite andesite alloy right what do we get for that we get the spout I really need to clean my inventory um can I just dump everything in a chest, as I always do? I really want to just dump everything in a chest. Um, right, so to make the basin, we need andesite alloy. That's fine. 
Yeah, where's the andesoit there? Andesoit? Andersite alloy. And we get some XP. I don't want that right now. And the blast bricks. The blast bricks is furnace is placed three by three by three. Okay, placing iron in the input slot along with coke or charcoal will allow you to produce steel. Okay. Okay, so in the mixer, we need sand, fish poop, and clay. And that gives you blast bricks. All right, so the mixer, we need more rotational stuff. Or, in the interests of mixer, there's the mixer. I could always, um... Okay, um, sorry about that. Um, got a parcel from my brother. Very nice care package. So, don't know if you're watching this, buddy, but thank you very much. Well, he should be watching because he has subscribed. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, thank you. That was, um, really cool. Right, um, mechanical mixer, basin. We need to attach cogwheel. We have... Those are deployers. Did I make? Yes, we did. Oh no, because it's got the pokey bit on it. It's not the same as the thing that was on the side here. Okay, right. Um, recipe filter. What do you do with the recipe filter? I guess if you want to put certain things in certain basins, that makes sense. And if I put a hand crank, where is our hand crank? Uh, large cog wheel. In case chain drive. What do you use in case chain drives for? W. Um, okay. Okay. So, it's kind of like a gearbox, but you can have more than one. I'm guessing. Okay. Did I pick up the, the chain, the cane? Chain drive. Chain drive. Um, in case chain drive. I will clear out my inventory, I promise, at some point. Alright, so, is this even in... No, it's not. Yes, it can. But you can... Alright, where is my wrench? Because I said that you can... They said that you can hit it on the side and it would turn it in the opposite direction. I really should make use of that toolbox or start putting my tools in the backpack where they're supposed to be. Um, right. Now that's not quite going to work unless I put shafts. Did I pick up the shafts? No, I didn't. Okay, let's have a look. I would need a gearbox. Let me just keep it simple. I will work it out at some point. Do I have any gearboxes? Depot. That's what I was thinking of. Uh, any gearboxes? Maybe? No? Alright. If we put the cogwheel, the cogwheels go faster, right? Yeah. I would need a gearbox here. Right, let's make a gearbox. Do I have that? No, I don't. All right, we are missing four cogwheels and we're missing shafts. Can we not make two sets? No, because we're missing more cogwheels. No, we have... Oh yeah, we need two. So what are we missing then? Just said it couldn't do it. Oh, stupid thing. All right, so if we put that there, that's turning. And if we do it... Okay, we'd have to make another gearbox and put it on top and um, all right another gearbox so now we're just missing everything can these no they don't i feel like i should be able to use these somehow that's quite funny Alright. But if you have an in case that's like having a row of gearboxes across. That's how we that no, so that's not what we want. 
that is not what we want and um max tour i think did tell me be careful while shifting shift clicking stuff in create which is why i had so much problems with the deployer um because i was shift clicking and it wasn't putting it in the right place all right I've, just as i remember that all right so we're gonna need another gearbox on top how did we do it on this side we got the two gearboxes oh we had no we can use a Belt. We don't need the gearbox. All right, Devaria. Thank you. Gearbox. Uh, mechanical belt. No, because that's pointing down. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I will work this out. Devaria, you need to move. You're kind of in the way. Come on, out the way. You're in the way. Um. No, you still need. You need another gearbox. Yeah, you would need another gearbox to get it to come up. All right, or maybe not. Okay. Maybe not. Um, turn you. Yes, now we need another shaft. Shaft, no, yes. Yes, that's going. All right, so how much stress do we now have on the system? It's 10%, awesome. So, um, that is not, is not rotating with enough speed. Still not rotate, okay, so that's not gonna give it enough speed. I thought if you, I know, but I think I think it's because that's rotating it. All right, so if we move it forward, then move this whole thing forward. Um, the chute was there. Come forward one. That is there. That comes out. That goes there. And then this goes here, yes, and that goes there, not enough speed. Okay, so then does that mean now I have to put in another cogwheel? Is that what gives it more speed? No, that's not what I wanted to do. All right, large cogwheel and W to ponder. Shifting from large to small. Then you double it. All right, maybe if, so if I make a small one, I think this is what bugs me about create because I don't understand. I feel like I need to have some kind of um engineering background maybe something some kind of maybe not engineering background but some kind of engineering understanding all right so if i put this here turn this up Uh, why have you now stopped working? There you go. No. You were just working. Why Why you no work? You were literally just... What, did I go and... I'll probably need the lever. <sighs> right. Gearbox, where are you? Spout, we don't need yet. Gearbox, yes. 
Now it's working. All right, large cogwheel. Little wheel. Can I put... Do I have another? Uh, Alright, so can I put... Okay, so is that enough force now? No. So why... I don't understand. Unless... It should be here. Okay, um... Maybe they should... Or maybe there's just not enough on the... Maybe the... I need to put more sails on the windmill? I, I don't know. Let me have a play around with it. And let me see if I can work out what's going on. Because I... Yeah, let me... Yeah, let, let me have a play. I will be back. Okay, um... I think I've solved the problem. Because I went and made more sails and put them on my my uh, windmill so it's turning faster this is going faster now this is turning i probably have way too many cogwheels here but you know we'll see right um so we want <laughs> it might help if i put them in properly right um and the sand and the clay okay it's doing yep it's doing stuff Ooh, it's doing stuff so how do i know when it's finished i guess it will rise back up Mixing noises. I don't have my sound up very loud, so I don't know what kind of noise it's making. But the subtitles, very, no, no. <gasps> I did it. It worked. Oh, oh. So I can get, no, that's not what I want. I want that hub fragment key. But yeah, that was, that was the problem. It wasn't turning fast enough. <sighs> I mean, it took me a, I, it took me a little bit to work it out, but I worked it out because I figured, well, it has to be. If it's not turning fast enough, maybe I need more sails. So I just did my usual overkill thing and just added more sails. But um, yeah, it's a good thing I've got all that string upstairs because that is annoying. All right, we want to turn that. Oh, you can turn her fragment keys into oh okay i guess after you've unlocked all your bits then you can turn them into coins all right should we go let's go this way nice so we have our what i should have done was not go up but go out but it doesn't matter. It's fine. Let me get some torches. I did end up dumping everything in a chest because my inventory was bugging me. Yes, I know, I know, I know. Um, don't know where my torches are. There they are. Right, let's go light up the other bit. Yeah. Oh, they're on my thing. Right, F7. Let's see where all the scary bits are. You, you, and in the corner, in the middle, in the other corner, in the middle, in the corner, and right in the very middle. Right, that's everything. That sail really does look like a monstrosity. <laughs> I wonder if we if I just filled it out into one big old square would that make it go faster? I don't know. I 
and I've just realized two of the sides are longer than the other two which is a bit bizarre but anyway ah right so um I guess that's the reason why it was telling us to make power because you'll need to make um your sales go faster well you need to supplement what we have which is um yeah should have guessed all right let's see let's claim all along here and force load it if you don't know how to claim them i should have explained that to claim your trunks you just need to drag your mouse across and then to force load it you press shift and then drag your mouse across and to unforce load them no and then you right click to get rid of your chunks so there there's that ah is this still is right i think this is right on the edge of my chunk but yeah we've unlocked another piece um next episode we will i'm thinking I want to, we have the storage terminal because we made that. Let me just finish off this bit and then I can do, I can, I can sort it out. Storage terminal, we did that. I did that. I can't remember where I put it, but I did it. Storage terminal, there. Right, so we get item pipes. And then the inventory connector. So that needs four of these. Oh, that's very simple. And treated wood planks. We want six. No, we just need one. We get inventory trim. But the connectors you get, you get one. It looks like you get one. But let's just finish that off. Um... And nope, press the button. Well, that's a lot faster. So I'll have to remember that you need more set. I'll, I'll have to try. Nope, you didn't like that. Why did you not like that? Why did you not like that? Treated wood planks and item pipes. I did that. Yeah, treated wood. Let's try that again. I've noticed that. That sometimes you'll put in a recipe. And even though it's the right thing. It doesn't like it. Oh, no, you know what? I probably put in the blast bricks. That might be it because they are the same color. Oh, okay. Ignore that then. I think I may have put in the blast bricks because they are the same colour. And button. Yeah, thinking about it, I, probably that's what I did. See, that's what happens when everything looks the same when you're, you know, old and can't see. <laughs> Okay, one inventory connector. There you go. Right. And we get six trim. Right. Now, I wanted that's I've done what I wanted to do, which was that. So, blaze burners. Okay, yeah, we don't have access to the end yet. Hammers? Okay not going there yet next episode we will be getting more power i think and i've got to think about how i want to um are we going to have a storage room no what's the point of having a storage room because we're going to get into applied energistics and that's gonna end up being one thing or well maybe i don't know i've got to think about how i want how i want things but anyway oh oh grief didn't mean to jump into the pool right so um but yeah i did what i wanted to do which was make the basin 
and make the and make the storage things. Let's put this up while I'm here chatting. So thanks very much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Uh, let's put this forward a bit. Because I want to be able to get behind there. Yes. So does this this is three by three by three. And I've just realized I can't talk and place blocks at the same time. <laughs> Uh, backpack? No, where's my engineer's hammer? Come on. I want to finish with the blast, blast bricks thing. Why have I lost my hammer? All right, that's really bugging me now. See, this is why I need a storage system. This is why I need a storage system. There it is. I swear I looked in that chest. And let's smack you. There you go. Right, so back to the ultra <laughs> again. Oh dear. Well, thanks for watching. Let's go over here because I'm more proud of my mixer than I am of the blast furnace. But thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.